Good morning, students and staff of St. John's Academy. Today is Monday, November 29th. Welcome back to school. I hope that you all had a great Thanksgiving break, that you're excited to be back today. Uh, as we begin a new week, it's also the beginning of the new church year. Uh, as we uh, started yesterday with the season of Advent, and of course, Advent is a time of preparation. And um, not only do we prepare during Advent for our Christmas Day for the celebration of the birth of our Lord, we also are preparing for His return. And we evaluate our lives during this time, and, and uh, I try to identify some areas that will help us grow in relationship with Him. And uh, one of those ways, of course, fits very well with uh, our virtues, right? As we study these virtues and grow in these virtues, we, we, we grow in holiness, we grow in relationship with our Lord. And uh, a fitting virtue for this week uh, is the virtue of generosity. So let's take a look at the definition of generosity. Generosity. Giving of oneself in a willing and cheerful manner for the good of others. So this virtue is um, right in line with the, the greatest two commandments, right? Love God with all our heart, with all our mind, with all our strength, and to love our neighbor as we love ourselves. And being generous is going to help us in both of those areas. When we're generous with our time with the Lord, um, you know, in prayer, uh, going to Mass, um, reading uh, spiritual books or reading the Bible, and uh, of course the, the Basilica of Father Piper are really uh, developing times now uh, more times for us to, to spend with our Lord in adoration. All these ways are, are ways in which we can be generous with, our, with the Lord. And of course, um, you know, as we're generous with others, that's a, a great way of showing them uh, our love, to sharing our love with them and, and obeying our Lord in, in those great two commandments. So uh, something to think about this, this week maybe uh, is to find different ways throughout the season of Advent that we can be generous with our Lord and with our neighbor. So uh, give some thought to that, and uh, I hope that all of us throughout the, the three weeks we have here, the four weeks that we have leading, leading up to Christmas Day, uh, can grow in this particular virtue. Uh, a couple other announcements. I know that we have a lot going on this week. A reminder that we're going to have Mass again Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, uh, Adoration on Tuesday, Priest Visits on Wednesday, Girls Basketball, I believe they have games Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, so a lot going on there. And, um, you know, so it's going to be a busy week. Uh, student Council, I see that you're doing a food drive, and so I would just like to uh, put a word out there for uh, our students to, to bring a non-perishable item, so a canned good, uh, something that can sit on the shelf for a while, ask mom and dad what might be appropriate to bring for the food drive at the school. Uh, but this is a great way of showing love for our neighbor by being generous, by sharing our gifts with those who are in need. So uh, please give some, some thought to uh, supporting the student council's food drive um, throughout this week. Okay, uh, with that being said, let's, let's begin our day in prayer, and uh, today I'd like to say the Lord's Prayer with you. So let's begin in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us for our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let's take a moment now to pause and pray for our personal intentions. We pray to the Lord, Lord, hear our prayer. St. John the Apostle, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. All right, let's stand now, place our hand over our hearts for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag 
of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Well done, everyone. I hope that you have a fabulous week. And know that uh, I'll be praying for all of us that in the season of Advent, we'll grow in holiness, we'll grow in relationship with our Lord, that we'll grow in generosity um, and our ability to give more time to our Lord and more love to one another uh, as we grow in holiness and as we aim to be saints. Have a great week.